go. So good evening, everyone. So we would be continuing our lesson uh, from Wednesday, the right? Wednesday last lesson. Rather. So we would be uh, tackling our lesson. Ano yung lesson? Natin? How to improve your English pronunciation. So meron tayong number one is alam. Improving sa so number one, tapos sa tayo sa listen to yourself, tapos sa tayo sa slow down, picture it. Number four, get physical. Tapos na rin tayo sa oh, wala pa tayo, oh, watch yourself. Tapos sa dahil tayo sa watch yourself sa number five. So let's go to number six. Number six is yung what we call is copy the copy the experts. So, let's talk about this. So, there are no replacement for learning pronunciation from the expert or what we call the native English speakers. These are what we call the American English or minsan the British English. But, British uh, American language is already okay. So, so basically, so what would you do? So, uh, sabi ka dito, so listen to English radio programs and watch television and movies in English. Hopefully, you are one of those people who loves to watch English films. Because when you watch English films, from time to time, you would learn how to speak English. Question, sino ba dito yung ano? Hindi na bo-board pag nakikipag-usap sa ing no hindi na bo-board pag nagdanonood ng English. Board? Hindi na bo-board or hindi na tutulog. Pasang kamay. Or baka yung iba sa inyo nanonood ng isang English movie ang nangyari ano nakatulog or naglabad ang ulo kay dili kay tinte. <laughs> naglabad naglabad ang ulo kay dili ka apas. Oh, hopefully hindi kay ganun ha. Hopefully you are doing good when it comes to watching English or okay na rin yung K-drama kasi 'di ba ang subtitles niya is English, 'di ba? So, papasa na rin 'yon. So, make sure that what you imitate what you're hearing even if you're not sure what they are saying yet. So, meron ako ipapagawa sa inyong challenge. Challenge ito ha. This time, nakita nyo sa TikTok. Yung sa ano god, sa flight stewardess. Welcome to the Pacific. Oh, oh, flight oh. stewardess? Oh. Yes, ma'am. Oh. Yun yung gagawin nyo. Kasi mas madali. Kung hindi kayo comfortable doon sa flight stewardess, doon naman sa DJ. Uh, this is all of them for five watching from yun, yun. or oh, pwede rin kayo tong babae or katong lalaki depende yan sa inyo ha pwede kayo mag ano you could choose ha oh, pwede do it pwede ikaw lang isa bahala po kayo ha kayo, kayo, kayo po ang bahala kung anong gagawin nyo dun sa challenge ha ha yes, so Gagawin niyo yung challenge nyo, so ipapasa niyo na siya next week lang. Ha? Para hindi kayo mahirapan. So, dalawa na yung video niyo, di ba? Ang first video niyo is yung Dolch Basic Sight Words. Next yung ano, video is... Yung ano first, yung... Dolch. Ang speech, ma'am, ang speech nung una. Speech nung una. First term pa tumo. First term ah, to siya. Sorry, sorry, first term to siya. <laughs> so, the, 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 ang extra exercise is yung, first is yung dolch, basic sight words. Then after that, you have the challenge sa yung, either you do the DJ challenge or the flight stewardess challenge. Mag-try ako mag-record buwas na sa akin para lingaw ta. So, I would record mine. 
Then after that, i-upload ko siya sa FB ko. After that, yung reply nyo, doon nyo i-upload sa Facebook ko. Ha? Sa comment, Tom? Sa comment? Sa comment, tong gagawin ko TikTok. Yes, Miss Franco? Bukas din ang deadline, ma. Hindi pa eh. Ay, sad lang. Sana all magaling mag-tiktok. Mag-download magaling pa ako sa app. So, hopefully you could do that. So, para galing-galing natin. So, for example, if you would be, ano nga, if you would be doubting yourself, especially in speaking English, you need to watch, ano, Ano lang ha, if you, this is just a suggestion. Please watch ano, Leia Salonga. Leia Salonga is one of the greatest uh, pronunciation. Lalo na pag sa English. Kasi ka Filipino siya. Mahirap pa. Uh, it's very uh, hard for us to to mimic or to copy someone who is American, di ba? From time to time, you, you watch uh, Leia Salonga. Sino ba bang magaling mag-English na Pinoy? Martin Yung true-blooded Pinoy, ha? Martin Rivera. No, Martin Rivera is ano, uh, American accent siya. American accent. Yung Pinoy accent talaga. Gary B, ma. Oh, si Gary B. Oh, magaling din si Gary B. Emeria Santiago, ma'am. <laughs> Oh, Miriam, Miriam Sariago at Perigo. Chris oh, Aquino. Chris Aquino. Yung mga ganong ano lang, level ng ng English. Kasi, mahirap rin naman kasi kung American English yung gagayahin nyo. Which is uh, very, ano, very ano yan, mahirap siya sabihin. Teka, it's a change ko muna yung akin. Camera. Okay. Ano oh, lang kabela gato ba? So next we have after copying the expert we have number two practice 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 English alone. Please remember that pronunciation problems persist because we are afraid to make mistakes. So from yes. time to time, ito siya pinakamasakit. Paano ka, how would you start improving your English if you are not practicing? Diba? You could not pinpoint the mistakes that you have. You cannot pinpoint your errors. Some of us will think, um, uh, kakayanin ko to, so I will do this when the time comes. Oh, no, it's yeah. not that because from time to time, if you have opportunity to speak English, eh, hindi ka sanay magsalita ng English. Hindi ka rin sanay mag-pronounce ng English. Diba? Sabi nga nila, practice makes perfect. So, pa ano mangyayari sa'yo pag hindi ka na practice, diba? So, that's why, diba, the last time in our class, I suggested to you that ano yung gagawin nyo? You talk to your nieces, you talk to your nephews, Indisin yun na indisin. Kahit on, may nagsuggest pa ako, di ba? You find an app. Mag-chat kayo. Mag-chat kayo ng mga foreigner, ng mga afam. Hindi na kayo mag-chat sa kanila ng yung text, ha? Yung messenger. You talk to them. Basta hindi lang masyadong se. Hindi lang masyadong masama yung ano nyo. Yung tinitext nyo. So make sure that, <laughs> that you practice. Uh, next, for example, you create scenarios or you act like meeting someone for the first time, ordering in a restaurant, asking for direction, then you act out the dialogue. And number one, don't be shy. Kasi nga, ito siya. I have asked some of my, ano, may, may mga kakilala ko. I asked some of them, uh, people who are teaching in other places, because I have friends who are or teaching in Vietnam. My, my teacher kasi tayo from Vietnam, si Ma'am Chanice, uh, from Ramon Magsaysay. Then I have known people from China, iba't ibang lugar. Pero hindi sila nahihiya po 
they are not afraid to speak English. Kaya kung sa ano nga ako sa Bisaya nga, English bakikaw, paayos sila. Sila nga hindi sila nahihiya because they just learned English. In the past, people learn English during their college pa. Pero ngayon, uh, some of the Asian countries are learning English early. Pero tayo mga Pinoy, we have English as our third or second language, di ba? Kung ano pa, mas magaling tayo sa kanila. Ba tayo mahihiya? The only part uh, na hindi lang tayo okay kasi hindi tayo nagpa-practice. Puha? So, dapat mag-practice tayo. So, yun na yung first practice natin na. Ang first practice natin yung Dolch Basic Sight Words. Then, the second one is the TikTok Challenge. Tingnan, tingnan natin kung kung mahiya pa kayo mag-English after na klase natin. Hopefully, after na klase natin, mga wala na kayong hiya. Hello, <laughs> mga. Um, one way also of, sige, hindi ko ito pagkagawa sa inyo, pero one way of doing, uh, practicing English is you keep on talking in front of the camera. Magsige ka mo kayaw-yaw. What if um, mamalikas ka mo sa English? Di ba mas masaya yun? Hmm? Baka naman ang iba sa inyo, magaling lang mag-English pag lasing na. Kumakita. Maski na ano-ano na lang yan, Val, ba uho na lang kayo bug naman. Ma'am, mas na, sa... mas nami mag-storya sa ibang nga lahi sa English kaysa sa kapwa mo Pilipino. Kaya nga, sabi ko sa inyo, mag-omigil kayo, di ba? Hindi kayo kung kay Pilipino, ma, ginapuna nila tala ng mali mo, ma'am. Ma may alatong sa YouTube, ma'am, ng teaching English siya, namin siya ba kayo makatoon nga yung sayang kanya, correct niya yung tanan niya grammar. Basta ara siya sa yun na nakatabi ko sa <laughs> Pero mas maganda pa rin, if you would be really, ano, uh, talking to a person. Kaya nga, di ba sabi ko sa inyo, eh, para hindi masyadong judgmental yung kinakausap nyo, kausapin yung mga pamangkin nyo, yung mga anak nyo. Di ba? Practice lang muna. Practice nyo muna yung mga anak nyo. Di ba sabi ko, kahit hindi mga kaintindi, basta makasabi na, uh, you try, for example, kay Miss Sally. Di ba may anak ka? Meron po. Sally. Oh. Try ni Sally magkausap sa anak niya mamaya one sentence lang. One yes, sentence sir. lang per day. Stop, ha? Nasagot nga din ako ng English. <laughs> oh, good for you. <laughs> Tapos, next week, magsabi, next week, magsabi na si Miss Sally ng isang paragraph. Daughter, you go there. You drink water. You get water. Mga po, mo Sit on the floor. Scroll. Or ido. <laughs> Run. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Uh -huh. And maybe after that, yung hindi na yung English na bakikaw ang gamitin nyo. Ito sa, I, I really know that you are not good in, in English because when I send assignments to you, ah, you are not, Zoom. you are not, you are not, you are not, you are not, you are not doing it on a complete sentence. Hindi po complete sentence yung sinasabi niyo during... Uh, question and answer. Lalo yung mga assignment ninyo. Diba? Napapansin, uh, I really see it in your assignments. Oh, somebody said, oh, by the way, in your examination, ang haba-haba ng ginawa kong direction, ang haba-haba, sabi ko pa ganito. And my, quiz, my exam, exam is my part pa doon sa ano, sa assignment nyo, diba? Anong ginawa nyo sa exam nyo? May nag-answer talaga three words lang. Kaya binigyan ko lang siya ng three. Huh? <laughs> oh, what happened to the exam? Ko, ang sumani. Tapos, di ba, I always encourage you to write your answers in a complete sentence. But sad to say, some of you are really not, don't really write it in a complete sentence. That's why uh, I'm, I, uh, Although, nag-check na ako ng mga activities nyo. 
Pero sabi ko, hindi talaga ito nila napansin ba na wala ko pa ginatsikan. Sana ginaayos nila itong mga answer nila. Pero sad to say, hindi nyo inaayos. <laughs> so, let's move on. So, please practice, ha? Practice English alone. Next. Find a language body. This is very hard for us. Find an English body. Getting feedback from an outside observer is crucial. Find a friend who is interested in improving their English. Try exchanging recorded messages so you can listen closely to each other's pronunciation. So, question. Could you do this? You find an accountability partner within your classmates? Yes, ma'am. Nahiya. You find an account... Ito lang ha, suggestion lang to siya. But I will not be... I will not be assigning you to do this really. Find an accountability partner when you could be talk when you would be talking to that person from time to time. And make sure that when you are talking to that person, you are talking in English. For example, you find someone, okay, girl, pag mag-chat tayo, pwede puro English lang. Parang private message lang muna. So it, when you you when you get comfortable in sending private message na English, why not ask the person na, girl, video call tayo, pero English lang, English lang. No, one minute lang, try, try lang. Oh, kaya, kaya yun? Yeah. <laughs> kaya, kaya yun? Kung required, gagawin. Pero kasi hindi required, hindi gagawin. <laughs> Lusot. Lusot, ba? So make sure that you you would find your accountability partner because we don't you, when you don't have your accountability partner hindi kayo mag-improve. Teka lang ha, kay lobat to akin laptop. Feeling ko hindi talaga siya gagawin unless it is an assignment. You would not really do that. Oh, uh, another suggestion. When you post on Facebook, I I'll be asking you. Sana mag-post kayo sa Facebook. Hindi na ano, hindi na Tagalog, hindi na Ilonggo. You post pa bright bright pagwapag pagwapag pa lang. You post on Facebook using English. Kaya yan? Kaya nyo kaya? Kaya ma'am, kaya ma'am. 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 Uh, so, so sige, from time to time when you when you will be asking me on ano uh, messenger sige ano na lang ito na lang magrule tayo pag meron kay tata if you would be asking me something from the messenger you would ask it to me in english oh. <laughs> wala wala na yung question sa messenger na call ba ma na call ba ana ma so kita pa lang mag type sa english na call ba ana <laughs> so sige, ganito na lang. I, I will make certain rules sa ano na. If you would be asking for me something, hindi ko sasagutin yung question if it is not, ano, if it is not written in English. English. Hello! <laughs> diba, mas maganda yun? I would not be, ano, I would not be answering your question if it is not in English. My God, it's so scary. Ay, ay, sorry! So scary! <laughs> so hopefully you would, you could find your language buddy. Okay, next. Please make sure that you pay attention to intonation and stresses. This is the most uh, scary part. Good pronunciation is more than just mastering individual sound. It is also understanding intonation. Intonation is what we call the rise and fall of the voice. <laughs> Tamang diin. Some sounds in words and some words in sentence are louder or clearer than the others. So, ano yung gagawin nyo? So, this is one way of doing to exercise your, I know, uh, language or your pronunciation. 
read some poems, speeches, and songs aloud, concentrating on the words, stress, and intonation. So, ganito na lang siya. I will not make you do this. Ha? Huh? Kasi, the activity here is, ano, ano yung sinasuggest dito? The activity suggests here that you read what? Poems, speeches, and songs aloud. So, nagpa-activity naman ako, di ba? Nag nagawa niyo naman yung, ano, yung speech. No? Yes, ma. Yes, ma. Uh, so, so, ang gagawin natin, what, what, what would I do is that I will just make the piece that you passed already. I nilipat ko na lang rin siya dito sa activity na to. Ha? Huh? But hopefully it is a good ano ha. Huh? Maganda ba 'yung pinagpapasa nyo? May words talaga ma'am na medyo alanganin. Uh, so sige lang, uh, let's make do na lang noon. Pero do I, I hope ha. Huh? Ito siya. Uh, after my after my watch that video the cup when you copy the speech hopefully when you do the challenge yung flight, att flight attendant and flight attendant and DJ challenge hopefully you have improved ha huh? baka naman hindi kayo nag-improve masakit yun you're fine <laughs> Go first. Masakit na. Masakit, ma'am. Kanila masakit na ano, ma'am. Kanila masakit ng ano. Wala, ma'am. Ang nivel, ah. Ang bahay, Mr. So, hopefully, please make sure that you concentrate. Meron kasi siya activity. Question. Na ano nyo ba? Have you checked the the materials that I posted yesterday? Have you checked the materials that I posted yesterday? Yes, ma'am. Diba, the materials posted there was just basic English, diba? Basic lang po siya. Yung kakao, how, bow, diba? So, I will... Asian, gentlemen. But I will not make you do that kasi hindi naman kailangan gawin yun. Let's ano naman, upgrade kasi mas maganda yung naka-upgrade tayo. So yun lang muna yung activity natin, yung dalawa, para ha, hindi kayo masyadong stress. Next, this is one of the best suggestion. This is one of the best suggestion. Pakibasa nga, ano, ano nga yung title ng isang suggestion? Sing a song. Very good, Mr. Apalaso. Apalaso. Sing a song. <laughs> Not all very good. Na, natatawa ba kayo? I'm very happy with this suggestion because learn the words to a popular English song and sing along. Singing helps you relax. <laughs> relax now. And just get the words out, as well as helping you with your rhythm and your intonation. Because you don't need to concentrate on constructing the sentence yourself. You just need to concentrate on making your pronunciation great. Kasi nga, diba, if you would be doing a speech, you would be concentrating on I, what would be the next thing that I would say. But, if you would be doing a song, I mean, in your, may, may memorize talaga kayong English na kanta. Yes, ma'am. May memorize ka. But the question is, kinaya ba ng bosses natin? Yung talaga sa atin. Yes, ma'am. Basic, ma'am. Basic. Basic. Okay. <laughs> so that's why, this is, uh, <laughs> this is this is one of the best suggestions because you would not be thinking of anything. You, you would just sing your heart. You would just see your heart out, right? Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. 
Iba golden buzzer na to. Okay, guwapoin yung tingo. Yes! Yes! Kumama, kumama. 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 Kumama, Governor. No, I would not make you do this actually, because ni naman lahat talaga very well ano. So dun lang talaga ako sa ano, mga pa speech speech, yung mga pa challenge challenge. Dun lang ako. Hindi ko yung pagagawin nito because it would be hard on you also. Yes, ma'am. So, so that was the ten suggestions on how could you improve your the 10 wait mm -hmm. so that was the 10 tips for perfect english pronunciation hopefully you've learned something and it would help you to what improve your english language pronunciation skills or your speaking skills so wait 